When it comes to carrying bicycles with a car, most of us think of roof racks or rear mounts, often maxing out at five bikes. But Skoda has reimagined this with a vehicle that may not hold the most bikes ever, but certainly carries them in the most eye-catching way. Enter the Skoda LNK 130, a one-of-a-kind pickup truck concept designed by a group of talented students from the Skoda Auto Vocational School. Now, before you do a double take, Skoda does not produce pickup trucks for the public. That makes this project even more special. The LNK 130 is not just a creative exercise, but a fully operational support vehicle built specifically for competitive cycling teams. Based on the plug-in hybrid version of the Skoda Superb Combi, this is the first time the students have chosen a PHEV as their foundation. A team of 28 students, supported by engineers and instructors, transformed the original wagon into something entirely different. The rear section behind the C-pillar was cut off and reshaped into a compact truck bed. That bed is not just for show either. It is capable of carrying three competition-level bicycles using modified carriers from the Skoda Accessories catalog. Why a cycling support truck? It all ties back to Skoda's roots. The company was founded by Václav Lorin and Václav Clement, who started with building bicycles over 125 years ago. Today, Skoda remains closely tied to the sport, acting as a long-standing sponsor of the Tour de France. To match its new function, the Superb underwent major bodywork revisions. The b and C-pillars were re-engineered, and the cargo area now features an electrically extendable section for easier bike access. Two bikes mount on racks in the bed, which tilt at a 35-degree angle for visibility and clearance. A third bike can ride on the roof using a matching carrier. One fun touch is that the rear passenger area only has a single seat. Behind it sits a partition with a window, adding structure and separating it from the bed. Even the rear doors got a clever update. Instead of opening the traditional way, they now slide outward and backward to avoid hitting parked bicycles. For added convenience, the doors include two exterior handles and reinforced locking mechanisms for safety. Visually, the LNK 130 is far from subtle. It sports a unique color scheme of red, gold, black, and white, a tribute to the classic Lorne and Clement branding. The grille even lights up with RGB LEDs to match the body color. Inside, the changes are minimal but impactful, with sporty front seats, custom upholstery, and 130 years embroidery on the headrests. Since this is meant to be used during races, the students went the extra mile by adding internet connectivity, a radio transmitter, and a performance monitoring display for real-time tracking during events. All told, over 2,000 hours of labor went into making this concept a reality. The LNK 130 will be shown to the public during the 112th Tour de France, taking place from July 5th to July 27th. The event will see 184 riders compete across France, starting in Lille Metropole and ending in Paris at the iconic Champs-Élysées. If you are a fan of innovative design, young engineering talent, or just love bikes and cars, this build is worth watching. Do not forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you do not miss our next video.